Are the theatrics really necessary? We're already on day two of the festival. The opening ceremony is over. <laughs> but my dear, dear Paimon, it seems you are not yet aware. That was not for my own sake, but for a special guest who's joining us today. <laughs> Director Hu's manner is as exuberant as ever. It always makes quite an impression. Oh boy! Now this is a surprise! Mr. Zhongli, I hope you are well. Xingqiu, what can you tell me about Mr. Zhongli? He seems like somebody very important. Yes, he's held in very high regard in Liyue Harbor. He's extremely erudite in many different domains of knowledge. Allow me to introduce you all to Zhang Li, a consultant at the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. His expertise is limitless, stretching from the celestial orbs to the terrestrial ores, spanning modern and ancient culture, delving into literature both prosaic and poetic. He may be my subordinate, but he is certainly a qualified poetry expert, and so we have invited him here tonight to judge the compositions. The director exaggerates. I am but vaguely acquainted with a few lines of classical poetry. Should you consider me to be remiss in my appraisal of your own compositions, please correct me. Ah, yeah, enough with the modesty already. If I didn't know better, I'd say you seemed nervous. Just focus on judging. Please rest assured that I shall rise to the occasion, director. Let me do a quick count. One, two, three, four. Great! Equal numbers on both sides. Huh? Are you counting me too? Okay, fine. But consider this a favor. Hmm, with our Fontaine friend present, perhaps we should rename this event to the Three Nations Congenial Poetry Gala. Also, I'm just noticing that Paimon should only count as a half-teammate at most. Hmm, that kind of puts Team Traveler at a bit of a disadvantage. Well, how about this? I'll join in as well. Director Hutel, here to help out in your hour of greatest need. What does everyone think? Naturally, the more the merrier. Being the host of the festival shouldn't stop you from having the chance to enjoy it like the rest of us. Then... It's settled. Everyone else in the audience, feel free to join in too and support your favorite team. What about me? Shall I keep track of the score? No need for that. The teams are just a formality. We're all friends here and this isn't intended to be competitive. But what do you think, Judge Zhongli? I concur, Director. Moreover, it would be disingenuous to impose upon our friends from Mondstadt and Fontaine a competition in which they are judged on how rigorously they can adhere to Leo poetic conventions. Since this is a congenial poetry gala, should we not begin with inspiration and finish with friendly conversation? The aim being for all participants to enjoy themselves. <sighs> That's a relief. I was so nervous about this, but it sounds like it's going to be pretty relaxed. Couldn't have asked for a better judge. Zhongli said everything I was supposed to say only far more eloquently. So, without further ado, I shall pass the baton to Venti. No problem. 